guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video, and today I'm bringing you guys episode number three of Pack Squads. And last episode, we ended off with a two game win streak. We're trying to bring it up to a third and fourth one this episode, and uh, there have been some pretty major changes with this team since the first episode. So we will uh, go through it before we start. I did take Matt Hargis's uh, team suggestion. I did also change around the defenders just a little bit, but we will go through the team before we start up a game. Uh, Chris Kreider, Richardson, and Terry on the first line. We got Slepeshev, Spooner, and Gregorenko on the second. We got Hoffman, Fraze, and Reeves on the third. And then we got the Burger <laughs> Burglar on the fourth line with Mitchell and uh, Lamasari. So that's how our offense is looking like. Going on to the defense now, we got Seidenberg, of course, Frank Kuz, and Polak. There is also Ristolainen, Koliakovo, and Party and Folin. So anyways, that's how our team is looking like. So let's get right into the first game here. Let's see if we can win this game. Alright guys, let's get this going. He's got a Doug Gilmore. Uh, I don't know who's on his left and right wing. The names are so hard to read on this uh, screen right now. But anyways, let's get this first game going. See what we can do. Come on! No! Oh my goodness. My defenders are so slow and who was that that beat me? Probably a fast guy on there maybe. I don't know. One to nothing already. It's Division 10. My guys just get outskated right now. Alex Gelchenyuk. All right, he's a pretty, uh, he's a pretty big quickster. So, anyways, one to nothing. Got to get that goal back. Oh, Polak off the post, off the crossbar. I mean, uh, one more chance. Seidenberg, back to the Polak. Uh, get by Johansson. There it is. Uh, can't get the shot on net. Oh, what? How do you miss that? Come on. Oh, there it is. Reeves! Yes, Reeves. No chance there. Cross creaser. Just slaps it in. There we go. One to one now. Nice little goal there. Alright, guys. So, end of the first period. I think we're playing pretty good. Uh, eight to three in shots. Three minutes time on attack to one minute. So, we are playing a pretty good game. Let's see if we can keep it up in the second period. Score a couple goals here. No, come on. Party. He's just couldn't poke the puck away from him. His players are a little bit faster than mine, but no excuses there. Two to one now in the second period. Gotta get that one back. There's a goal. Two to two. Nice snipe by uh I think that was Slepishev. The slowster. Alright, anyways, nice little goal there. We tie it back up. Let's get another one. Oh, Kreider's got the speed. The backhand forehand. Oh, off the post. Couldn't tuck it in. Come on, Terry. Grab the puck. All right, let's go, Mitchell. Beat him on the outside. Lamasari with no helmet. Circle around. Uh, just snipe it. Yes, there it is. Lamasari. I'm not sure if that's his second goal. I don't know what he's doing there, but we're absolutely owning him right now, and uh, I don't know. We got the lead at least. Not the most impressive goal, I guess, in Division 10, but... Alright, anyways, we'll keep going here until he, like, unpauses the game. Alright, look at that. He does rage quit out of this game. Um, I mean, there was only 15 seconds left, and he didn't want to claim the coins. He just had enough of it. I mean, should have got the coins anyways, but anyways, we did win with a score of 3-2. to two. Let's go ahead and buy one 17,500 pack and one 8750 pack. I'll meet you guys there. Okay, guys, so we're on a three-game win streak. Like I said, we can buy one 17.5k pack and one 87.50 pack. So let's go ahead and open up the gold premium first before we do the gold premium jumbo. I probably should show you guys, like, the team of the week and stuff. Uh, there is a team of the week, Drew Doughty. Um, I'll have to go through it uh, after this pack, maybe. This pack, oh, Alexander Galchenyuk. Uh, we got Andriov and Stoner. Uh, Galchenyuk, why did I say Galchenyuk? Okay, we'll, we can definitely use those players, so let's uh, select those. We also got a home Edmonton Oilers jersey. Change Team Ottawa, so those are pretty useful. Send those to the collection, and then we'll go ahead and open up that 17k pack. 
yeah, probably should show you what is in the Team of the Week because it did come out pretty recently. There are some special cards like uh, Orpic Milestone, uh, Kreutzer uh, Milestone as well. And those are some of the notable Team of the Weeks, Drew Doughty, Anderson, Sedin, and Kessler. So uh, let's see if this 17.5k pack can bring us some luck. Even though Alexander Galchenyuk, that is a pretty good pickup for Division 10. So let's see what else we can get in this pack. Show us the money. Show us 80, another 85. That would be pretty nice. This pack, uh, I think that's Roman Polak again. Oh god, another duplicate. We got Prust, we got Weber, we got Juris, uh, Dano, um, Cole. I mean, recently traded Dano for Andrew Ladd. Um, home Carolina jersey, a lot of jerseys. Skidari, another good defenseman. We also got an assistant captain card. And we got a starting goaltender. Alright, pretty good 17.5k pack. There's also a captain card there, but we don't exactly need it right now. So let's send all those guys to the collection, and then we'll build a team from there. Alright guys, so we're just one game off of Division 9, and this team is actually looking pretty good. I mean, it's not the best team ever, but it's something we can work with for sure. And there's a lot of new faces after opening up those two packs, so we will go through the team and how I kind of built around it. So first of all, it is Chris Kreider, Galchenyuk, and uh, Terry on the first line. I did put uh, an assistant captain card on Galchenyuk um, because he's one of the highest overall players. I think it will complement well with Chris Kreider. As well as on the second, we got Dano, uh, we got Richardson and Gregor Renko. On the third, we got Spooner, Fraze, and Reeves. And on the fourth, we got Andrioff, Mitchell, and Jura. So a whole bunch of new players getting rid of those silver guys. Our team is looking a lot more solid. On the second, or on our defense here, we got Seidenberg, we got the new Yannick Weber, uh, who's playing on the first line right defenseman spot, and our new goalie, uh, Kadobin, uh, pretty nice, Kadobin. Uh, but there's also on the second line, Cole Yakubo and Rista Linen. Didn't really want to move around those guys because they do have some chemistry together, and honestly, it's not that bad of a D pairing, as well as Roman Polak and Stoner on the third line. So anyways, that is how the team is looking like. Let's get started into the second game here. Let's try to win that division title. Alright, let's do this brand new team we're working with. He's got uh, Couturier, Haglin, and Aginla on his first line. So definitely not a bad team as well. Let's get right into it. Let's see what we can do. Wow. Literally just two minutes in and he scores a goal with, who is that? Number 27. Um, don't know who that is, but he makes it one to nothing. Just trickles by... Uh, our goalie at Kadobin. Not a good start. Dougie Hamilton. Alright. I guess not a bad goal there. One to nothing. We gotta get right back. Oh! Nice little goal by Chris Kreider. I thought he was gonna block it because he did lay down at the perfect time. But still, one to one. A little laggy there, but that's okay. Let's keep it going now. We scored with only like three minutes uh, in from that last goal. So, not bad. Oh, right there, we get another goal. Nice little cycle down low. And we shoot a short side with Reeves. Oh, man, his second goal of uh, two games. That's pretty nice. Man, he's our new goal scorer. All right, anyways, 2-1 to one now. Let's keep it up. Oh, nice little snipe by Gelchenyuk. I can't say his name properly. I don't know what's with it. But uh, the new assistant captain on our first line does a nice little drag, and we snipe it uh, short side there. So, nice little goal by Galchenyuk. 3-1 to one in the first period. Oh, and there is another rage quit. Alright, so that is how we're going to get into Division 9. Three different rage quits in this uh, season, I guess. But 11-3 in shots, 3 minutes time on attack to 1 minute. He just had enough. And he did quit the game. So, right now we are going into Division 9. Nice little quick game. I might start another game. Ooh, I, I don't know. That was a pretty quick game. We didn't even get into the second period yet. But anyways, we can open up two 17.5k packs because we are on a uh, four-game win streak now. And look at that. We are in Division 9 now, so we should be facing some harder opponents. What am I doing? I'm so used to Hunt Roulette. So, let's open up the first pack here. Open up the 17.5k pack. And let's see what we get. I think I will leave another game for the next episode 
because the next episode we can uh, open up a special pack if we can get a five game win streak, which is pretty exciting. So first pack here, we're going to get uh, Roosevelt, Forbort, uh, pretty awesome goalie right there, Eddie Lack. And we also got a nice little backup goaltender, uh, James Reimer. We could use Kari Ramo if any of them are fatigued, I guess. But uh, Roosevelt, Eddie Lack, Forbort, uh, Reimer, Ramo, Berikovsky as well. Uh, we need some more left wingers, so that's pretty nice. And we also got Fiddler. Oh god, okay, we might have to just use him for our new coach because he does have some better stats than the other guy, Davidson. Uh, we got to change team Boston, we could use that. Uh, I know Spooner is on Boston there. And we also got a leg injury, I will keep that. And yeah, that's a pretty good pack, so we'll send all that to the collection. Quick sell the rest of this pack, and then we'll move on to the next one. Alright, so let's go on to the next pack here. See if we can uh, get one of those Team of the Week cards. I, I would really like that. Something that we can look forward to playing in the next game of uh, Pack Squads. Alright, so next pack here. Show us an 86 plus player. Can we get it? Uh, we got Alexander Burrows. Alright, that's not a bad card for sure. We need some more left wingers. Uh, we got Gostad as well. Not many gold rare players, so not too many upgrades for sure. But still a pretty good pack. Another Fiddler. We got an Edmonton Oilers change or jersey. Uh, home um, jersey for Los Angeles as well as Timmy Brent. So anyways, that is how it's looking like right now. Send those guys to the collection. And we'll go ahead and build the team once again. Alright guys, so I'm pretty much going to wrap up the episode here. I know it was a pretty quick episode because we did get two rage quits, but I want to save Division 9 for the next episode, and there is a chance we can buy a special pack in that one. So there's a lot more things to look forward to in that episode than this one. Even though our team is looking a lot better going into Division 9, obviously our team isn't amazing, but I did throw together all the highest overall players on this team so far. So I will go through it before we end off this episode, and you guys can once again give me some more line suggestions. Even though I think the team keeps changing so fast, it doesn't really matter about the line suggestions too much, because whatever I play right now should seem okay. But right now, Chris Kreider, Galchenyuk, and Terry on the first line. We got Dano, uh, Richardson, and Burroughs on the second. We got Jokinen, Gostin, and Birakovsky, a whole new third line on our third line. As well as on our fourth, we got Reeves, Sezikis, and Lance Boma. So that is how the offense is looking like. On the defense, has changed by a little bit as well. Uh, Seidenberg, we got a new starting goaltender, Eddie Lack, an 85 overall goalie. I don't know when the next time we're going to come across a goalie, so that is a pretty nice pickup, as well as Yannick Weber. We got Roosevelt. We also got Forbort in there, as well as Stoner and Roman Polak. So that is how our defense is looking. Uh, we did pull a couple change teams, like the change team New Jersey in the second episode, and a change team Boston in this episode. However, I'm thinking instead of like putting it on a player right now, and you know maybe the player, you know the team's going to constantly keep changing in the next few episodes. Maybe it's worth just saving until we get some superstar players, maybe like an 86, 87 overall player where we can actually put that change team Boston or that change team New Jersey rather than wasting it on some players that are kind of disposable right now. So anyways, that's pretty much it for this episode. If you guys did enjoy it, leave it a like. And that's about it, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. 